today I'm filming a week in my life, HKU edition. Let me know if you guys want a day in my life version. I'll go into more detail about stuff like my makeup, my skincare. But I thought since I'm showing you about what I study, a week would be more effective. I usually just sit by my table and do my skincare and makeup, choose my outfit, and I head out the door within an hour. Let me show you my favorite section in the room. Every day I do my skincare and then my makeup and then I, my accessories are all here. What should we do today? I think Burberry. So right now, I'm actually heading to the university bus. There's a university bus that goes directly from my area to the university. So my first class of the day is comparative literature. Weather in Hong Kong is always so unpredictable. This week it was 21, now it's so gloomy. I recommend this course if you're into stuff like movies, texts, proses. Though I don't like it that much because I prefer poems. My class is all the way at CPD so we're gonna head there now. It's fun if you like analyzing texts but the concepts are really abstract. Let's go. Now we are going to CYM for our lunch. I think it's objectively one of the best places to eat at HKU. Whoa, they have a lot of beef surprisingly. I went to do my blood work recently and they told me I have to eat more iron. It's like noodles. Made with purely corn yet. Eat your greens. Really this is the first time they have it in stock. Right now, we'll be heading to a theatre. We have this rehearsal for clearing. It's a common core course that we are taking. Me and June volunteered as photographers for this. And after we do this, we don't have to do a final project. Ah! Okay, I had to remove the audio because I wouldn't want to get demonetized. But I'm pretty sure you all know what song this is. The Aye Aye. Hit you with that. Aye Aye. It is currently 6.30 and we are going to this Sedders workshop. I think it's on language but it's a requirement for my CV. Currently 8 and I'm back at my dorm. We are done with the talk. I think I'm gonna go back, cook some dinner, and maybe catch up on my Demon Slayer. So I'll see you tomorrow. It's gonna be really exciting tomorrow. It is now Tuesday and my first class is Chinese. If you guys didn't know, I'm actually Chinese, but I never grew up speaking Chinese. But I thought I'd get in touch with my roots and learn some Chinese. What's wrong with this? We'll be having a quiz today, so I'll be preparing for that. We are done with our Chinese quiz, now we are going to journalism. Hell yeah. <laughs> we have a short one hour lecture and then after that we are going to the court. We're matching matching today. As always. It's the high court. We are at the grocery store slash food court thingy. Department store was it? We are trying to get our lunch here. Yes. Oh, oh this looks good. <gasps> so fast. Cute. What are we getting, guys? I don't know. Should we get Japanese food? Or should we get salad? So we have some salad, pasta. Yeah, exactly. Look at that, all the pie. The fruit cups look so yummy. This purple is I got a kale salad. So all my friends really went home, it's just me and you. I'm thinking of just stopping by nearby campus to get some groceries and I'm going back. Good morning everyone! 
Wednesday, which means I'm gonna be a photographer today. I'm planning to do a screening and I'll be taking videos of the audience and such. Today I'll dress a bit more casually and appropriate for walking around the whole auditorium. Hey guys, so the first class that we have is criminology, which is basically what is crime, how white people commit crime and stuff like that. It makes us lots of like psychology law aspects. It is under sociology though. I might not have enough time to film because I'll be busy taking but videos. Is but... <laughs> seen uh, very much so in places like New York. We just finished filming for Clearing. We're gonna go have lunch at Tham Dai. My brother told me that Tham Dai is like the McDonald's of Hong Kong because of how often people eat it. I have a hot take. I actually don't like Tham Dai. I know a lot of locals love it, but. Other their, their tomato soup and then they gave me noodles that were not fully cooked. Yeah, like stiff noodles. You basically choose your soup, your toppings and then yeah, that's it. This one is a mix of all the different things. Last time I took Songla and then I got stomach ache for three days. There was this random weird guy who was like, he kept talking to us. At first I already knew he was suspicious because he was being so friendly. Yeah. And people are usually not mm. So he was like, oh, can you clean this guy's okay, stuff? And okay. he was like telling us, like, I was pointing to this to Jill. And he was like telling us, oh, yes, that's the one that I ordered. So I was too afraid to not answer. So I just went along. I was like, yeah, 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 it's too much for us. He was like, but it's not too much for me. Huh? I can eat a lot. I want to eat a lot. And then after that, he started randomly commenting on other people. He was like, you know those other kids, they order so much. You know how much they ordered? 100 HKD. He was saying it all in Cantonese, you know? So I was sitting like this the whole time because he was sitting there. I was sitting like this because I didn't want to talk to him. But he was like looking at the menu. I was like, oh my god, I hope he leaves soon. Is he going to order more? So he was looking at the menu. He was like, oh, thank god I ordered this. Now it's sold out already. Then he started yapping about his work. He was like, every day I go to work. It's so jam every day. Saying up hi to you again, then he started yapping about nonsense, you know. Oh yeah, I was like, oh my god, it's so spicy. And he was like, yeah, I can't eat spicy food. And I was like, why am I talking to him? Okay, he was really weird. Was she's weird too. She's yapping. She's yapping. Yeah, but so far, most of the Tamzai experiences I've had was not good. Ah, she said I'm gonna anger the Hong Kong community. <laughs> oh, this is. But then it wasn't, the camera wasn't on. <laughs> the camera wasn't on. <laughs> 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 it's so annoying. It's so annoying. We just finished Chinese. She's so kind. She was helping me with Taobao stuff. Seriously recommend taking this class. I feel like she fits kindergarten. Yeah. yeah. 
Yang Lao Shi. I feel like she suits kindergarten way more than teaching us. But we're basically kindergartners. <laughs> Gonna go eat now at Kebab House. Hello, fellow kimchi. We're wearing from the lightest to the darker. <laughs> Looks so good. This is the beef with rice. This is the best thing at Kebab House. And then the onions help with the freshness and cut the grease. Whoa, that looks so good. Girl, I'm gonna pour this manta all over your face. Mm, oh, this is like A and W fry. This also what is what makes it. That's why the biryani is shit. That is always like a hit of this here. <laughs> no, Hiva does this. She'll be in the middle of eating, and then she'll be this shit basin basin. <laughs> Two thousand words to get LGBT again. We have three billion. Hey guys, so I'm back in my dorm now and it's officially the end of this vlog. I don't have any lectures on Friday because a really good tip is to leave your Fridays blank or leave at least one day blank so that you can have time to rest and do your assignments. So what I usually do after my classes are I finish my assignments or my readings or I take a nap and like watch movies or I edit. Thanks for following me all throughout this week. Well, four days but you know. Let me know if you like more vlogs like this and if I should do a day in my life. Make sure you go check out my other social medias for more of me. I do fashion, posing, photography tips over there. And I share slices of my daily life there too. So yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye!